All right, well, we're giving, today we're giving these girls a bigger box. I'm also gonna try something new and see if I can have these girls draw out a bunch of comb. Look at that, I'm drawing it out. Oh yeah. This hive has been doing very well. So that's why I would like to see if I can get them to draw out a bunch of comb for us. Look at that. We got a bunch of eggs in there. And nectar, looking like nectar. You can see that down there, that's drone comb. It's bigger. You got a bunch of nectar in that one. Some eggs. Some eggs in this one and some nectar also. More eggs and nectar. Just caught the white dot. See that queen? Beautiful job she's doing. And these, they're still drying out. I'm gonna leave these. Wow, girls. Let's start with this box, or this frame here. Bunch of nectar. Push that to the side for now. Make sure I get all of the brood in the center. A little bit of brood, cat brood. Some larvae and eggs. Some more cat brood. Larvae and cat brood. Larvae and cat brood. Some eggs. Larvae and cat brood. Some more eggs, larvae and cat brood. All right, this one. Look at this frame. They've really drawn this one out. Look how, look how wide that is on that side. And this one is all capped brood. A little bit of larvae. I don't see any eggs in this one. Some capped brood and some more larvae. Look at all those bees. Go to their new home. This is my plan. Plan on feeding them heavy with a frame feeder. So I'm gonna feed them with the frame feeder. And then also, I'm gonna put a rapid round on top. And I'm gonna see if I can get them to draw this out really fast. Now all I plan on doing is filling this with syrup, pumping it to them, see if they'll draw out the other combs for me so I can get more combs drawn out. And that's basically it. So I'll put a honey super on here to cover this up, put the lid on. Let's go check the other nukes, see how they're doing. And I also wanted to say that I found a hive beetle my first time ever. So I wanna check that hive and see what's going on in it. So this was the hive. I found something goofy in it, never seen before, and it was a little black beetle. And I thought, can't be a hive beetle. But I was told by someone local that they've never had beetles in our area, hive beetles. 
then I told by someone that's a little north of me that they've had them so what I did is I put oil on this tree so let's see what we got because that kind of scary if we have high beetles I'm gonna have to get some traps and put it in all these We've got hype beetles. Look at there, there's one alive right there. See it crawling? So there's a dead one, there's a dead one, another dead one, another one, another one. There's quite a bit of hive beetles, so that's kind of concerning to me. Let's take a look at it and see what's going on. Look at there, right off the bat, there's a hive beetle. Got him. Hive looks like it's doing better than what it was last time I've been in here. Frame of honey. They're not adding or bringing any more to it. Not doing nothing to that frame. Nothing on that frame. If I don't see a bunch of brood, I think I'm gonna get rid of this queen. Put a different hive in here. Or a different queen. There's some eggs, but not many. She never really produced for us. And I put a lot of stuff in here for her. Come on, honey. I wanna see a bunch of cat brood, not just that little bit. Some emerging brood there, some eggs and larvae. There's the queen. Eggs, larvae, egg, larvae, cat brood. Eggs, larvae, cat brood. Ooh, some nectar. So they're bringing in some stuff. So I think I'm gonna do is set this one up and I'm gonna feed them also. Now remember, this hive is a week behind the last nuke we just went in. So let's see if we can upgrade their box. Oh, they don't look crowded. I'm thinking they can wait. Okay, so got a lot of bee bread. Some nectar and bee bread. See that brand new fuzzy bee right there? There's no eggs whatsoever on this one. Okay, some brood there. 
eggs down in there and larvae. <clears throat> Some cat brood, larvae, eggs. Oh, and then she does that. Look at her. She's right there. Beautiful frame. Bunch of them hatching right now. Gorgeous. That's what I want to see. Look at that. There we go. And I think if I give them a box, I can also feed them, get them so she's laying really good. Okay, so they started drying out that one on that side, but not this side. Lots of brood and larvae on this one. Same on this side. Look at that. And then she's right there on that frame in the center, towards the bottom. She got every cell filled with an egg. Oh, look at that brood. So she's doing well too. Oh, they're drawing the top one out. Starting to. A little bit of brood. No eggs. A little bit of brood there. No eggs. They are bringing in a lot of pollen. <clears throat> Baskets are full. Look at that. A lot of pollen's coming in right now. We needed that. Decided to leave that one for another two weeks, let it get caught up. It's gonna have a bunch of brood emerging here in the next couple of days. So then it'll help expand and they can grow from there. Um, plus, I really wanna see if this is gonna work by pumping the feed and making sure that they're always well fed. And if it is, then I'm going to do the same to them and see if I can build them up enough. And then this winter, this fall, I will give them two to two. Right now I'm giving them one to one to see if that helps. Now this colony here that had the hive beetles, they were looking dry. So that's why I get them one to one. And I'm hoping they start building. You know, Italian supposed to be known for growing fast and being big brood. So... She might be defective, I don't know. She's not doing it so far, she's got plenty of bees in there, so I'm hoping they turn around. If nothing else, I'll get rid of her and I'll put uh, one of the other queens I made in there. So far though, I'm up to nine hives, and I am hoping I can keep that until next spring. So, and the other thing I gotta start doing now, because we're gonna be coming into August, is I need to start doing mite treatments. I wanna make sure these girls make it through winter, and that's the only way to do it. You see my little pallet stash here? I'm, I wanna build. I wanna get up, I wanna get a bunch of hives. So I gotta fill up those pallets. So yeah, we'll see how that goes with the building of that other hive over there. And hopefully everything goes well, so.